honey making process is started by a honeybee visiting a flower and gathering some of its nectar. Many plants use nectar as a way of attracting insects to stop at the flower. When the honeybee gathers nectar, the honeybee then transfers pollen grains from one flower to another and pollinates that flower. Most flower nectars are similar to that of sugar water, a mixture of sucrose and water. To make the honey, two things happen. Enzymes that the bee produce turn the sucrose into glucose and fructose. A small amount of the glucose is attacked by a second enzyme, glucose oxidase. This is then converted into gluconic acid and hydrogen peroxide. The gluconic acid turns the honey acidic with a low pH that is inhospitable to bacteria, mold and fungi. The hydrogen peroxide gives the honey a short range protection against these same organisms when the honey is ripening or diluted for larvae food. Then the honeybee evaporates most of the moisture out of the nectar, leaving just 18% water in the honey. All these processes help to make honey a very stable food as it naturally resists mold, fungi and other bacteria, allowing it to last for years without refrigeration.